everything in our career. I'm that kid who grew up listening to Alabama, and all of those songs mean something to me. You walk in a club somewhere, and people are still playing those songs, and, and radio still plays those songs. They are the true definition of entertainment. They they, they, they come with the goods, you know, they have the great songs. So they, it's hit after hit after hit after hit. They have the, the sound. You know, Alabama to me, um, as, a, as a whole, was just one of the best shows I've ever seen. My parents brought me to a, an Alabama concert when I was uh, 12 or 13. It was at a rodeo down in Houston. I remember as a kid, you know, thinking how big it was, how big that sound was. I always said that Randy was, in my opinion, one of the best pure entertainers I'd ever seen. You know, through his voice, the songs, and, you know, his charisma on stage, he had people in the palm of his hand. You get jokes, you get dancing, you get, you know, you get this really great energy that is really entertainment one-on-one. Jeff, his double neck guitar, you know, doing that thing was always cool. Teddy sitting over there in his, you know, Bahama hat or whatever it was he used to wear. We were side stage. I mean, I, I was videoing the whole time, just sending it to my parents saying, I can't believe we're watching side stage. And I mean, the crowd was just going nuts, singing every word. And uh, I mean, that watching them that one time, I mean, at where we were at in our, in our career, I mean, made us want to step up our game and, and continue to push and try to put on the best show and sing better, you know, write better songs. And they're, they're still an inspiration to, to us and other artists today, which is, which is awesome. Watching the act reaction those guys got from the crowd was part of what made me want to be a, an entertainer. I want to be that guy. I want to be in the band, and I want to be standing right in the middle of the stage and singing and entertaining people. They still have a, a deep amount of passion after all these years, and if I can, if I can have a career like Alabama has, and then you know, come back and still enjoy it. That's, that's what's inspiring for me, ho holding on to that love for music and, and, and spreading, spreading that to guys like me. And especially when you see heroes of yours that, that uh, are, are ever. Have been inducted into the Country Music Hall of Fame. They are the rarest of breeds in music. They made it to the top. And stayed there. As few do for decades. And while doing that, they rewrote how it's done. Their music is a soundtrack to my life. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage, Alabama! Oh, my God. 